Good morning, boys and girls. You may notice that we're doing the morning message outside today. It's pretty early and Mrs. Converse still asleep, so we're going to give this a go. Uh, if any buses or trucks drive by, then I might have to edit it out, or maybe you'll just see me pause and hear a loud noise. We'll see how we go. Anyway, the date today is May 4th, so may the 4th be with you. It's Monday. I uh, hope everybody had a good weekend, and we'll check in with the weather over the weekend as well. So Saturday, eh, a little warmer, still rainy though. Sunday, spectacular. I'm really hoping everybody had the chance to get outside and enjoy that stunning weather. Um, I myself did some gardening with Mrs. Comper and just uh, hanging out outside, enjoying a coffee and the sunshine. Um, today, it looks like it's going to be a little cooler and partly cloudy, so maybe yesterday was a special treat, but hopefully we'll see more of that to come. Uh, I'm going to show you guys my drawing challenge from last week, even though, to be honest, I only finished it on the weekend. Uh, this week, I figured I'd go with something a little more small and cartoony, so I picked a chameleon, and uh, we'll see if you guys want to do that or pick your own. There goes a bus. I'll find out later how loud that is on the recording. Um, yeah, anyway, uh, in math this week, we're going to be looking at fractions. A dump truck. There it goes. We're going to be looking at fractions, and fractions are equal parts of something. So any kind of a food, usually things that come in a circle, we often use the example of pizzas, or cookies, or cakes, you know, you name it. Uh, there's some delicious examples when we're talking about fractions, and fractions are when you take that whole thing and you divide it into equal parts for sharing. Uh, so we're going to be looking at lots of examples of that this week and probably for the next few weeks. So good luck as we start off a new, uh, a new math unit. Um, I have scheduled a class meeting for 12 o'clock tomorrow, which is Tuesday, so I'm going to keep this message kind of short. Um, we'll have more time to talk then. Um, but in the meantime, I hope everyone had a terrific weekend. Hoping we're going to have a great week of learning this week, and you guys will be hearing from me very soon. See you later.